In this video, I'll show you the fastest way to synchronize audio in Premiere Pro. Hi everyone, I'm the Web Guru and I do tutorials on video, photography, and audio. So be sure to leave a comment and subscribe. So here in Premiere Pro, I've already imported my footage and you can see it over here. And I'm simply gonna drag it into the timeline. So I have my camera and I'm gonna drag that to video track one. And that also has some associated audio on audio track one. And then I'm gonna add my screen capture to video track two. And then it also has some associated audio on audio two. And then finally I have my voiceover. And my voiceover was recorded with a professional microphone on an audio recorder. And I'm gonna bring that to audio track three. Now everything is in the timeline, but it's not synchronized. So I really can't edit it yet until I synchronize it. In order to do that, it's pretty simple. I'm just going to drag with my mouse to select everything. You can also use the keyboard shortcut Command A or Control A for select all. Then you just need to right click and choose synchronize. Then you can select this last option, audio, track channel one. And then Premiere will analyze the audio waveforms and automatically synchronize all of the clips. Now, in order for this to work, you do have to have audio for every single clip. And then you need to put everything on a separate track. So you'll notice that I stacked one on top of the other on separate tracks, and then this should work fine. Now, just to double check, I'm gonna click on this little wrench icon and then expand all tracks. I'm gonna zoom in a little bit here. And just by looking at it, I can see that the audio waveforms are actually all lining up with each other. So it looks like it worked. And then when I listen to it, Sounds like everything is working great. So now I'm going to mute audio track one and two. And by double clicking here, I can reduce their height because I'm really just interested in audio track three, which is my professional recorded voiceover. And now I can continue with my edit now that everything is nicely synchronized. Now, sometimes these tracks up here, the ones that I've muted are called scratch tracks. Some people decide to delete those. I like to keep them just in case something goes wrong and I have to figure out what happened. But the main audio is gonna be this one on audio track three. So that's about it. Uh, a lot of people don't realize how simple and quick and easy it is to synchronize your audio inside of Premiere Pro. So I hope this video was uh, helpful to you. Please leave a comment and subscribe and keep learning and growing and I'll see you in the next video.